So I'm going to play here, Roman, one of the first ever scenes for Makarov that this is the first time we're introduced to him. Obviously, this is a very famous scene, No Russian, which we talked about last time, um, which is a very controversial mission. Let's play it and let's see your reaction. Man, Makarov is fighting his own war and he has no rules, no boundaries. He doesn't flinch at torture, human trafficking or genocide. He's not loyal to a flag or a country or any set of ideals. He trades blood for money. He's your new best friend. You don't want to know what it's cost already to put you next to him. It will cost you a piece of yourself. It will cost nothing compared to everything you'll save. So not a nice man we're tracking down. Snammy ball. Remember, no Russian. Now we know why it's controversial. <laughs> um, I do remember this scene. You do remember it? Well, yeah, watching it uh, uh, with other people, yes. Yeah, it's um, a gruesome, sickly scene, that's it, for sure. Isn't it? All these bodies laying on the ground, and, and I think what's so controversial about it is the player is in control. Mm -hmm. So as you can see here, you're actually taking control and you can actually shoot the civilian. But you'll notice, Roman, I don't okay, shoot Harry, anyone. Go. Why didn't you shoot anyone? <laughs> because I'm a nice guy. I don't know. I want to know how you've delivered every line with such perfection. I, I mean, I would want to give credit to the directors. It's uh, they, they knew what they wanted. It's just fascinating to me that you went in thinking this is just another job in the voice booth, and then here we are, ten years later, literally one of the most iconic voices and characters in the history of video games. Yeah, never thought I would be the lead this bad guy, that's for sure. But your next game needs to be a hero, I think. Mm. No? Nah. You don't do heroes? I don't do <laughs> what, what is it about you don't like about heroes? I, you know, because I, it was my dream to be, a, to play a Romeo or, um, but it never came through or came true. and. My characters are always villains, and I've kind of came to grips with that. But there's uh, there's something natural about it because I feel that deep down inside we all have a mean streak within us. Uh, not all, but a lot of people do. Uh, there's, 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 there's definitely saints, and um, I don't know. I just I think the mean streak is more fun. So don't you agree? It can be, yeah. You're, <laughs> it can be. I mean, when we're acting, of course. If, if you're acting, it's especially well, fun because you get to play around, don't you, a little bit? Yeah. Mm. Well, it's not because you're not allowed to. In real life, you're not allowed to show your meanness. Uh, when you do show it, the world turns against you. So video games is your basically your uh, way of expressing your true feelings that are hidden deep inside you and nobody judges you by them so out of, in your entire career how many good guys have you played versus bad guys let's just break it down like that uh only in theater i played good isn't and, that interesting uh, when when you're fully exposed in theater there is a few um good guys that you've played no it's 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 just the acting industry uh you your agents typecast you because they feel 
that's the way to get your foot in the door. And uh, so, and being Russian, uh, Russia and the United States have been in quarrel for as long as we know. So therefore, it's automatic. Your foot in the door, you're going to be a Russian bad guy. So is it kind of like a thing in Hollywood or acting where if you're Russian, chances are you'll be playing someone bad? A hundred percent. And you've come to yeah. grips with that. Is that what you were saying? Yeah, mm. oh, absolutely. Well, I, I'd rather be working than trying to push me as a good guy. <laughs> True. All right, this is an iconic scene that everyone plays back. This has millions of views online, so I'm going to play it for you now and we can get your reaction. Hold your fire. No, Shavilitis, get it. We sent a strong message to this attack, Makarov. That was no message. This is a message. The Americans thought he could deceive us. When they find that body, all of Russia will cry for war. Very eerie. All of Russia will cry for war. Yes. Um, it's, it's a plan. Russians have... We've been in war a lot of, pretty much all the time. So, military is when I was growing up, that was what I wanted to be. Really? Oh yeah. Uh, when I was born, my father is. Uh, um, both of my grandparents were in the military. Uh, my grandfather from my mother's side was in the Red Army, and uh, then he worked for. The government, the secret, what I, I don't know exactly, but I, I know he was doing something with the military. Yeah. And then from my father's side, my grandfather was also, and he had lots of medals. My grandmother had medals. Both of my grandmothers had medals. Your grandmothers? So. Wow. Yes. Wow. Shit. So, yeah, so I've... Uh, pretty much raised in the military environment. I've, I mean, I've had, I remember going to their closets and I was pulling out the mat, gas mask, put that on, put all of their uniforms on, walk around. Wow. <laughs> and I had a machine gun. So that was always been my dream is to be in, in, in uh, I mean, but that's, that's, every boy's, majority of boys' dreams, I think, is the always, Games do you play when you were kids? Get a yeah. gun, you shoot things. <laughs> That's why. Do you so think I, if you grew up at this era, you'd be playing games like Call of Duty shooter games? Uh, most likely, I'm because I'm, it's it's so um, it's so engrossed. You just you, it's so real. You just you live in a different world, mm. and it's that's why I think everyone's playing video games. That's why everyone on the phone is because it's so it's fun. You can you can take different shapes, look different ways, and do your thing without really working for it, without really doing it outside, and bringing out that dark nature. In you.